Omonoba Nedo Ukwa Kolokolo, AYE II, or Power of Benin, has emphasized that restrengthening the nation's security apparatus will enable them to brace up to the prevailing nation nationwide security challenges that is threatening its corporate existence. The Benin monarch made this passionate appeal when the participants, Senior Executive Course 43 of 2020, from the National Institute for Policy and Strategic Studies, NIPSS Akuru, paid him a courtesy call in his palace in Benin City, the Edo State Capital. Omono Barnedo uh, drew the attention of the visiting participants from the National Institute to the series of calls by traditional rulers and corporate bodies for the advisory roles to be enshrined in the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and to be implemented as they also serve as peacemakers and bridge builders between the multilingual communities across Nigeria. Well, thank you very much for the confidence you have, confidence in coming here to seek our blessing, uh, the blessing of God Almighty through, through ourselves. Um, and also to make a contribution to your, your role as a NIPS, the think tank of uh, the Federal Government of Nigeria. Uh, security agencies to be empowered to carry out their work, empowered both you know, financially and otherwise, to, to carry out their role as security agencies of the country. We always appreciate the role of the army. And we still appeal to the federal government to please strengthen the security agencies. Earlier, the leader of the participants and the directing staff of National Institute for Policy and Strategic Studies, Rear Admiral E.O. Jayola, informed the Benin throne that they were in a door stage on a local study tour of the state as part of understudying the country with a view to finding out why policies turned out in the past are never utilized to therefore clearly articulate a blueprint for the execution and implementation of policies made up for the good of the entire country. Our visit to the Royal Majesty Palace this evening it's not just for the fatherly blessing. It is for us to get fatherly advice and admonitions as to what we can put together, particularly looking at the key roles of the traditional institutions in the country.